How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. Today we're looking at some terrifying ghost videos that are sure to make you a believer. So hit that subscribe button and get ready for more creepy content just like this. Areas that once served as battlefields in the countless wars that humanity has fought are often considered to be important historical landmarks. Tourists flock to these locations every day to explore the sites where some of history's bloodiest battles have been fought. However, not all battlefield tourists are history buffs. Some make their visits to the battlefield in search of an answer to the question, are ghosts real? In July of 1863, the American Civil War reached a fevered pitch when the Confederate soldiers launched their attack on the northern town of Gettysburg, Pennsylvania. This battle would prove to be the turning point in the war. The Union victory at Gettysburg was the first of many victories that would lead the northern states to win the war as they pushed their enemies back towards the south. In this three-day battle, over 7,500 soldiers lost their lives. When people die in violent or tragic ways, it's said that it's more likely that their spirits will linger on the earth after death. For this reason, Gettysburg is often considered one of the most haunted cities in the world. In this video uploaded to YouTube by Yankee Reb, a group of amateur ghost hunters visits a Gettysburg battlefield in the dark of night in hopes of capturing one of these infamous ghosts on film. They park their car on the road near the battlefield, the darkness slightly illuminated by the car's headlights. For several minutes, the only thing that the camera records is a set of antique cannons lined up alongside the road. Eventually, the Civil War weapons yield up something far more interesting. As the camera rolls, a pale white shape begins to form just behind the cannons. The shape moves closer to the road, and it eventually becomes clear that this could be the ghostly form of a Civil War soldier. No way. What is that? The figure walks around the front of one of the cannons, then disappears as suddenly as it arrived. I have no friggin' idea. Did you get that on the camera? I, it's recording. Could this be the ghost of an unfortunate soldier who lost his life behind one of these same cannons? More importantly, does this answer the question, are ghosts real? YouTuber Donnie Drunkard believes that he has the answer to the question, are ghosts real? In fact, he's relatively certain that a ghost, or perhaps a demon, has chosen his home as its eternal resting place. According to him, the shadow figure usually appears at the top of his stairs or in the basement. He says that he only ever sees short glimpses of the entity, but he's certain that it's there. It moves quickly in his peripheral vision, making it difficult for him to get a clear look at it. He decides to try and lure the ghost out so he can capture evidence on video. This YouTuber has experience with ghost hunting, including recording EVP, so he believes that he'll be able to capture footage of the elusive phantom. He sets up cameras in the two spots where the entity usually appears. To provoke the spirit into appearing, he plays Christian gospel music. Because he believes that the spirit is demonic in nature, he theorizes that the religious tunes will anger it and provoke it into showing itself. With the camera rolling and the music playing, he sits down to wait for the spirit to hopefully make an appearance. About 20 minutes after the YouTuber begins playing the music, a shadow quickly passes in front of the camera placed at the top of the stairs. A few seconds later, the light fixture hanging from the ceiling begins to move all on its own. The footage returns to the basement, where some bottles can be heard falling to the ground. This signals to our YouTuber that the entity is present. He calls out fearfully, attempting to communicate with it. The entity never appears on the basement camera, but the falling bottles indicate that it was present. I hear you. Hopefully, Donnie is able to placate the spirit that has invaded his peaceful home. YouTuber Triple I 3 AMR, another amateur ghost hunter searching for evidence of the spirit world, recorded this eerie video in June of 2019. In this video, he heads to an abandoned complex late one night, armed with a flashlight and a camera. 
hoping to capture the terrifying image of a ghost. Only a few minutes into his ghost hunting adventure, his camera picks up something terrifying. As he heads towards the doorway of one of the structures, he shines his flashlight through the door. He's still several yards away from the structure, but clearly he wants to make sure that there won't be any surprises waiting for him when he enters. Unfortunately, the structure is not as empty as it seems. Peeking out from behind a wall inside the structure, he sees a dark figure with a large head and glowing white eyes. The entity seems to be watching him. Even after the flashlight illuminates the creature, it doesn't move. Unlike many recordings of shadow entities, this is more than just a fleeting glimpse. The YouTuber runs into the building where he saw the entity, hoping for a closer look. By the time he arrives at the spot where he saw the ghost, it's gone. He continues his exploration, hoping to capture more footage of the bizarre shadow entity. He walks around the rooms in the rundown abandoned building, finding nothing but trash and empty corridors. After a few minutes, he heads back outside to try one of the other buildings in the complex. Once again, he spots the eerie shadow creature's glowing eyes peering out from inside a building. This time, it watches him through a window. Once again, it disappears before he gets too close. He finds no trace of the creature inside the building. One final time, he heads outside and once more, the entity can be seen watching him through a window. This time, our YouTuber's attempt to approach the entity is interrupted by a terrified scream. He's unable to locate the source of the cries, but clearly believes the terrifying shadow entity is to blame. The Campo Grande High Security Prison is probably the last place anyone would expect to spot a ghost. However, prisons are not uncommon places for ghosts to appear. In fact, Alcatraz, a former high security prison, is one of the most haunted places in the United States. YouTube channel Carayo Estado shared the video from the high security prison in Brazil, and it's taken social media by storm. The footage from a security camera shows the outside of a cell block late one evening. For the most part, everyone is asleep at this hour, so the beginning of the video shows everything to be quiet and peaceful. After a few seconds, the stillness of the image is interrupted, when a strange shadow seems to emerge from the ground. The shape of the shadow is strange. The top is round and then flows straight down. It almost brings to mind the stereotypical image of a child pretending to be a ghost by putting a sheet over their head. The shadow rises up and seems to hover a few feet above the ground. It floats around the outdoor scaffolding for a while, moving more like a mist than anything corporeal. After exploring for around a minute, the shadow disappears suddenly into the ground once again. The State Penitentiary System Administration Agency has denied that the video depicts a ghost. According to the agency, the entity is simply the shadow of a person who was walking around in the dark. However, no one is admitted to being in the area at the time the video was recorded. In addition, viewers have pointed out that the shadow clearly flies from the ground at various points, making it impossible that it was human in nature. So, are ghosts real? The staff of this prison have certainly become believers. Before we get to that number one spot and take a look at some terrifying poltergeist activity captured in an abandoned building, remember to hit that subscribe button and turn on channel notifications. That way you'll be in the loop about all our latest creepy content. When it comes to capturing spiritual activity on camera, poltergeists are a goldmine. The main thing that separates a poltergeist from a typical ghost is that poltergeists have the ability to interact with their environments. They can move objects, turn off lights, and even physically attack the humans unfortunate enough to dwell in the same space. 
This makes poltergeist activity significantly easier to capture on film. YouTube channel Nerve Paranorm set out to capture such footage in a creepy abandoned house, rumoured to be haunted by a poltergeist. The YouTuber wanders around the house attempting to attract the attention of the ghost. After a few minutes, a loud whistle prompts the poltergeist to move a chair resting just outside the view of the camera. A few minutes later, while he's attempting to open a door inside the house, another door nearby begins to violently rattle. The door is locked from the outside, but the ghost hunters are understandably disturbed by the violent sounds. They approach the door to investigate and it begins to rattle even louder. A loud banging sound from the floor below draws their attention away from the door. As they begin to walk down the stairs, the door at the top of the landing that was locked only seconds before swings open all on its own. <laughs> Nervously, the YouTubers decide to ascend the old staircase. At the top, they find an old dusty attic. After exploring for a few minutes, they find nothing that could explain the door rattling on its own. Is it possible some sort of spirit was trapped in the attic, just waiting to be released? It's hard to tell if these bizarre occurrences were recorded with the help of a sneaky accomplice. The footage certainly looks genuine, and staging such a long, drawn-out video in a creepy abandoned house that's falling to pieces would certainly take some planning. This eerie footage certainly makes you wonder, are ghosts real? If you want more creepy ghost footage, then check out that link on the top there. Otherwise, there's a scary playlist there you can binge on. Leave us a comment down below if you enjoyed this video or hit that thumbs up button. And that's it for me. I'll see you all next time. Peace!